Welcome back. It's week 19, that's it. All the training is done and um, it's just a case now of staying injury free and, uh, and getting that 50k done next week. So we've had 20 weeks of training now, which is 940 kilometers um, traveled. That's 92, over 92 runs. Um, I've done what, a marathon, a half marathon, uh, 10k races, so yeah, it's been it's been good, yeah. Uh, somehow, touch wood, stayed uh, pretty much injury free and um, yeah, really looking forward to getting this race done. And uh, yeah, the last training run I did was just a 10k run. I didn't really fancy putting a, um, a big video together for that one, so what I've done is I've actually put together a nice little montage of all of my runs. Um, so if you're interested and you've got a spare eight minutes, enjoy this little montage.
Okay, thank you for sitting through that. Um, I know you've probably watched it all before, and um, and yeah, I won't be offended if you just whizzed it forward to this point. So, um, yeah, I thought I'd give you a little lowdown on how the training plan's gone. So I'll move over a little bit, put it up here. Hopefully I haven't gone out of the screen, but um, yeah, so you'll see my training plan and how it's gone. Um, you know, where my rest days are. I've done quite a lot of hill repeats in this as well. So um, yeah, it's been a bit different for me. My previous training has been a bit sort of, you know, just go out and run, get the distance in, but um, I've really felt the benefit, I think, this time, fingers crossed, of, um, of sticking those hill, hilly runs in and uh, where I can and those, um, those hill repeats. So yeah, that's definitely something I'm gonna take forward um, for the next races. Um, lastly, before I go, um, I'll just let you know a little bit about races coming up. Um, so I haven't really got anything planned in the summer. Um, I actually have two marathons so I've signed up to. Um, I've got the, um, I've got a new forest marathon in September. Um, I'll put the details here. And also the week after, which is the London Marathon, but I think it's that. I don't know anyone who did, um, unless they've got a charity spot. Um, I've actually signed up to uh, a race that's local to me and it's actually called Not the London Marathon. So I think it's like eight loops of like the River Thames. But um, so yeah, what I might do is, is cause it's only two, you know a week in between, I'm gonna probably take it easy on the, um, on the sort of the first one, you know, when we're going around the New Forest, you know, treat it as like a nice little trail run. And then I might go for a bit of a pacier one on, uh, on the towpath. So I've got that. Um, and then lastly, I've actually signed up to a race for 2023, I know, I know, pretty organized. Um, in March 2023, which is the Sussex Ultra, I believe. Um, it's uh, by Endurance Life, but um, yeah, I'll stick the details there. And um, yeah, so that's gonna give me something really uh, big to train for, um, uh, for next year. So over Christmas and that, I've got no excuse. I can't just sit there and eat mince pies. You know, I've got to, I've got to uh, get their training in. Anyway, the next time I see you, I will be at Denby's on a Sunday morning, taking on a 50K Ultra. Anyway, until then, see you later.